Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel. In today's video, we're checking out this new Transformer. Here we have Game Edition 08, or Cybertron Decepticon Soldier. Let's check out the packaging, with the usual logos. Large window where you get a better look at the Soldier. Cool image of the figure, Game Edition 08. Another cool image on the side. Here we are at the back. Here we have two images of the Soldier in Robot and Cybertronian Vehicle Mode. It takes 12 steps to transform this deluxe class figure. The set the con soldiers capture the Autobots and transport them to Kaon Prison. Here's an image on the side. He's the deluxe class transformer. Now let's crack on and check out the figure. Here's everything unpacked. Here's the detailed backdrop, which is Saving State Prime. Here's the soldier. Now let's get him off the packaging. Here is the figure unpacked. He is unable to stand due to how he's packed, so we have to transform his legs so he can stand up. After transforming his legs, he is now able to stand up. Here he is on the detailed backdrop with his one accessory. The figure has this really nice looking deco, mainly grey with these cool looking green sections, purple Decepticon logo, and orange faceplate. I'll show you the articulation. Head can move up and down like this, and left or right. There's articulation in the arms, but they're restricted at the shoulders. They can move up like this, bend at the elbows, and hands can move all the way around. And there's some articulation in the waist. Moving down to the legs, they can move forward and backwards. Like the shoulders, they only move out so far. And they bend at the knees. And then articulation in the feet. He comes with one accessory, a Neutron Assault Rifle. Now let's attach it to him. To attach his weapon, you have to remove his arm, and it fits like this. Now let's look on the figure, he looks really cool, I love his green highlights. Here's a side view of him. Here's the back, here's a small Decepticon logo, and here's the other side. For comparison, here is next to a previous Studio Series Gamer Edition release, and it's Barricade. This Gamer Edition Soldier is a heavy retool of Gamer Edition Barricade. Almost every part of the previous figure has been replaced, they come with identical Neutron Assault Rifles. With the soldier, they've updated his feet so they're a lot smaller compared to Barricade. With the latest Game Edition release, this is the fourth Game Edition Decepticon. Here he is alongside Megatron and Starscream. With these figures side by side, they look pretty cool together. Now let's transform the soldier into a Cybertronian vehicle mode. After 12 steps, here's the soldier transformed in a Cybertronian vehicle mode. First impression, the vehicle looks pretty slick, and I love the green paint scheme. He can get a better look at the green paint scheme. There's purple highlights on the wheels, just here, and headlights. Here on the other side, as well as the con logo, just here. Here we have a side view of the vehicle, you can see how slick it is. Here's the front. Here's the other side. Here's the back. And here's the top. Here's where it attaches weapon. And here's underneath. Here we have alongside barricade, also in vehicle mode. Barricade also has purple highlights, but his are a lot darker. Both of the assault rifles attached to the roof. Barricade is black, while the soldiers is grey. The Decepticon soldier looks really cool in vehicle mode, compared to his clunky looking robot mode. Once again, I really like the green paint scheme on the vehicle, along with the subtle purple highlights. 
There's also Game Edition Ratchet due out soon. Keep an eye out for a future video. Hope you enjoyed this video, guys. Thanks for watching.